See, this is a postcard I received this week from uh, Germany. And you look at that animal on the front of that card and you see the focus that animal has trying to get across from one area where they started to jump from to where they're going to land. Now, if that animal is distracted by any means, they're going to miss their target of where they want to get to in life. Moreover, at the same time, with that focus and the desire also creates a situation of vulnerability. This animal is not protected in this particular state. And that's okay. That's the circle of life. But this animal has a focus and direction. And we too have a focus and direction. And we need to make sure that we are not distracted from the things that matter to us most. And to make sure that while we're focused on our goals, while we're on our journey through life, that we're not distracted from getting from A to B by some other kind of things going on. Like, for example, that was a little bit of Hawaii and a little bit of something else. But anyway, see, distractions. It takes you away from where you want to go. And in, in life, um, so many things take you away from where your true desire is and distract you and get you riled up in areas that take you away from your true purpose and, and the plan that's set out before yourself. If you're a boxer and so forth, I'm not a boxer by any means, but your opponent in boxing knows your weaknesses and know your strengths. He's going to stay away from your strengths or he'll turn away your turn your strengths into your weaknesses by distracting you. And your weaknesses set you up every time and those weaknesses provide an opportunity for them to use that strategy, use those opportunities to work against you and to uh, have them turn the tables on you. For example, politics is great and it's interesting and it's compelling and it's a lot of drama with it. But sometimes if you watch too much of that stuff, it can suck you into a vortex where that's all you're focusing on. And you're not focusing on what you can do to make the world a better place. Some of it's exhibited through politics, but you can lose yourself in all those different uh, chasms and uh, abysses that are associated with that and, and the polarizing views and so forth. So that's a social thing that one may do on a regular basis, but can find yourself becoming too worked up, too upset about it, and, and so on, and distracting from your your energy from where you really need to be putting it towards. As well, <laughs> you can not care about those things and so forth and also, uh, you know, and find yourself caught in a problem where you are uh, out of touch with uh, things that way. So, it's a, always a fine line whether it's something you like or love um, can sometimes um, draw your attention away or through your activities to draw you away from where you're focus should be on so uh, I know a few things and uh, I, I like to uh, spread joy and happiness where I can obviously that's why I do the postcard stuff but also to try and be supporting loving caring individual and all the things that I do and it's a constant reminder when I get upset or get outside of my realm to go back and really focus on where I should be heading and to take a deep breath on that process anyway just some rambly bits and pieces here on a evening. Anyway, don't worry. This is not this is not a YouTube video log uniform by any means. It appears that way, but it's not. So don't 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 be worried. Uh, for those that are watching, wondering what the hell I'm talking about. Anyway, stay true to yourself. Keep your dreams alive.